Well, we are in a state forest campground just outside of Alpena, Michigan. I cannot pronounce the name. Osiniki? Osiniki? Been here for a couple days over the weekend in early June. Here we are. Site 15. Campground has about I'm not even sure, 60 sites. About 15 or 20 of them are on the water. I have the van. We'll bring it around to show you the site. Just a standard picnic table, fire ring. I am here for a couple days, so I set up the gazebo with the van. I have a gazelle gazebo. I'm not sure if I ever showed this. With uh, just a little table. Put a chair in there. It's nice to get in there. This is the only site, and it's kind of odd, the only site with its own marker. Historical marker. And this historical marker, if you can read this, is actually a grave site buried here in 1865 after his body washed up ashore and there is the one single stone born 1839 died 1865 the 6th of November he was trying to sail across Thunder Bay in the 6th of November and yes, this campsite does back right up to Lake Huron, Thunder Bay to be specific. Just a short little 50, maybe 75 yard walk, 50 yards over here to the shoreline. take you out here to the water. It's a beautiful sunny day. 60, 65 degrees in the second week of June 2020. We have our own little private stretch of beach. Being Sunday afternoon, most people left a couple hours ago. There are a couple campers still here. You know, way down the beach, you can see a couple different people sitting in chairs, soaking up the sun. It's 65 degrees, it's a little cool, but in the sun, it's not too bad. I did get up early this morning to watch the sunrise. Did a time lapse of it coming up. I also tried to do a night lapse with the GoPro, and I've tried that on a couple different occasions. It never seems to work out. I can't get the settings right. It's just too dark. Even the brightest stars are just pinpoints of light. But the sunrise has come out pretty decent. You can see each site has a little gap in the fence. I think that's just to channelize people's walking so the fragile vegetation on the dunes don't get too eroded, or at least keeps everybody kind of herded to one area. You can see about 30 yards away over there is another site. There was a couple there in a tent for the last couple days. They packed up and left a couple hours ago. And they have their own little gap in the fence to walk out to the beach.
and that is the State Forest Campsite here in, I cannot pronounce it, Okan, Okanee, Okaness, just outside of Alpena, Michigan. What a beautiful day.